All right, we are live. Well, not live. <laughs> um, cool. Well, um, just a quick recap, and then we can, you know, you guys Hello? Are you still there? Hello. This is banging on his keyboard. <laughs> Is that how you normally play a monkey? Just roll. Good <laughs> It's like back in a while. Say stuff that was like that. Was that a car accident? <laughs> <laughs> I hope everyone's okay. And was wearing their seatbelts. That was hmm. sounded like a violent crash. Um, Chris, you with us? He muted his mic. He must be still setting up. All right. So I'll just do a quick recap, and then you guys, you got some planning to do, I guess, on how you want to get down to uh, uh, this little cave in the side of the cliff. But you left Camp Vengeance on foot and into the jungles of Cholt on your way to Oralunga. After a series of strange encounters with a fairy dragon fond of pranks, you ran into Artisimber and Dragon uh, Bait yet again. Yet again in trouble, in fact. Um, while initially the onslaught of Velociraptors seemed the main concern, the stakes were raised when an enormous zombie T Rex emerged from the jungle, vomited bodies which rose as zombies to join the fight. Wicked cool. Yeah. Um, <laughs> battle raged until Baloo successfully turned the zombie T-Rex with an entreaty to Torm. Um, afterward, you stopped at Mbala, it being on the way to Oralunga and the Oracle Saja Mbaza. Uh, you encountered an impossibly old woman named Nene Pupu, who advised she alone was able to bring people back from the dead despite the death curse. And that if the party agreed to run off the Terra folk, she said, destroyed Mbala, she would agree to perform the rite on one of the party members should they unfortunately meet their end. And uh, here's, here's where we are. Um, I guess you guys need to figure out how you want to approach this. It's a cave. But it's down, I don't know, maybe 15, 20 feet or so straight down this ledge. And beyond that is a precipitous drop, possibly to your death. Um, does any of our magic users know minor illusion? I'm thinking maybe if we can cast something in front of that. Do you have a picture or anything? Oh. <laughs> a picture. <laughs> Well, we could just make lots of noise and get them to come out and try and fight us, but they would more than likely retreat there at some point and then climb down once we've reduced their numbers by ranged attacks. But... You know me, I'm all for them ranged attacks. <laughs> but if we if we show an illusion, then maybe they'll come out in, in force. I'm just worried that if we make noise, it may not be enough. No. Oh. We're going to make noise going down there, aren't we not? Right, but if we go down there, then one of us could die. But if we cast an illusion, can anybody even cast an illusion before I, I vote, even continue? I vote, I vote that Nimbus go first. <laughs> I think it makes more sense that the heaviest, the heaviest of us go down. I will break the ropes, my friend. And who will bring you back up? I am the one who's stronger than... <laughs> All right. Well, if we're going to do that, um, what if Mr. Slan is lowered down and he throws a fireball into the cave and then we pull him back up and we don't have to worry about things coming after him because they'll be on fire? That is true. I like that. I think it would be better if we send, uh, you know, Nimbus down there, and I'll just give him the ability to breathe into the cave, and then he can, you know, burn everything that way. I'm not. Can you do down. that? Yeah, it's, man, I did it last time. It was if really can, cool. If you can do that, I I will definitely do. It. I will. It's, 
it gave I'm... me lots of heartburn, but it was good. All right. If Mr. Snan, you can give me that ability, I will let you lower me down and uh, and and breathe fire into that cave. Well, ideally, sure. we, need, we need to see the look. Is there any way for us to look before we go down? Look in the cave? Sure. I mean, I guess if you lower me down slowly, I can look into the cave. Uh, hopefully, they don't see me, though. What, what time of day is it? What time of day is it? <laughs> uh, <laughs> character actor, I see. Uh, let's Thank see. You. Um, let's see. What time did you get there? It took you a while. Maybe a little afternoon, early afternoon. Okay, so there's still light out. Um, I mean, I'll. I can try if you want to lower What's me the down. Like? <laughs> We all need to know the weather. Yeah, we need a five-day good... forecast for... Yeah, that was Bala. a good point. Let's roll it up. Extremely warm and dry. Oh, so that means it's sunny. So Tabaxel's at a sunny. disadvantage. Yeah, Tabaxel and yeah. Snarn for Cat that. Cat pulled down. Oh, and Nimbus um, too. Are, Nimbus, are you light sensitive? No, I am not. Okay, good. Really? That's weird. I got. Yeah, I'm not. I don't believe so. I'll double check my stats, but... I yeah, believe. I thought goblins used to. It must be just orcs. Yeah, but I, I know it's trap, but yeah, maybe that's old editions. Maybe yeah, yeah. There's so many editions crammed in my head. It's just yeah. All right, so if we lower me down, I can look in the cave very quickly. See, which I'll be honest. Regardless of what I see, I'm going to say I see a lot of Petri folk. Um, <laughs> then I will light a fire into the cave. Mr. Blue, you will pull me up using every bit of your strength as quickly as possible. You got it. And how high up are we? <laughs> and I look over the edge. Uh, we, <laughs> are, we are dead high. Yeah, right. 1,500 feet, I think it said. If you look at the little thing while you were fixing your stuff and making lots of noise, damage we would take. Oh, geez. 67 points, by the way. On average. Yeah. Well, on average. Only rolled two sixes on that one. So, yeah. But you rolled, you rolled two ones. There's a, a few twos, some fours, and a couple fives. It's a, it's a, what is that? A slightly, that's about an average roll, isn't it? Reroll. Better than medium. Reroll. Yeah, something like that. All 69. Right. <laughs> oh, God. All right. Um, uh, so what's the plan? We're going to, you're going to tie a rope to Nimbus and have him. Yes. Oh, boy. Yes, we are. What could go wrong? Right. And Mr. Snob, do you have to, uh, do you have to, um, Empower me with the abilities prior to breathe fire. Well, yeah, I'd have to, you know, give you the ability. You can't just do it without me giving you the ability. Give me the ability, sir. Wait, wait, how long so, does wait, that last wait, once you wait, have wait, you? That's a good point. Minute. Wait a minute. Why don't we get all this stuff out? So I, I go into the bag of holding and pull out my 50 feet of rope. And then who, who else has rope? I have rope. I, do. I have fifty feet of hemp rope. I think it's a popular yeah. item. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah, me too. So okay, so we have how many feet? Two hundred feet? Yeah, it's only about twenty feet or so down the side Yes, of but the redundancy is always good. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. What Someone was that? Cut. Redundancy is always good. Say again. Redundancy. <laughs> oh, I see what you're doing. <laughs> I don't get it. You guys. Are- he's trying to say he's he's rednecker than you. Oh, <laughs> yes, he is. Okay. Um, <laughs> so, uh, is there anything to tie the tie the ropes to? Yeah, there are a couple of trees. Uh, they're sparsely planted, uh, all about. But uh, yeah, so tree. So we we tie two ropes ropes together, and we tie one end of the tree and one end to to. Oh, Nimbus. Yes. And then I would tie two ropes together and I tie one rope to Nimbus and one rope to me. 
Okay. Um, yeah. And that way we have the one to pull you up and the one to catch you if something goes wrong and one to catch both of us, which you'll be ripped in half. So you'll be okay. <laughs> if <God>. I... <laughs> So like my so basically my ropes tied to the rope that the both ropes that are around him are tied to each other. So if I fall off, there's a, two hundred feet of rope to catch me. I might get hurt, but at least I. Okay. At least it's, I got you. Yeah, a little. Uh, yeah. So so I'm at four measure. lengths of rope, and okay. then he's tied in the middle. All right. And now I start wrapping it around him, and I drop him down like a yo-yo. <laughs> so Make no. a... Wait, I need to be empowered first. <laughs> Don't worry, stuff will come up after this. Do you want to take a look first, or? Uh, well, hold on. Uh, has Snarn given me the ability to breathe the fire? Not yet. How long does that last? It lasts one minute. Oh, okay. So you're gonna. So I'm gonna have to signal you, and Snarn, I, Snarn, I will signal you. You will grant me the ability. I will breathe the fire, and then I will so be pulled back up. You have so, to be back up here for me to do it. So, I wait. Need... Oh, so can you? Oh, I have to be in front of you to do it. She's trying to touch you. All right. So why don't you touch me now, <laughs> and then lower as quickly as possible? I'll look and then I'll shoot fire. That should be within a minute. Well, what if you don't want to shoot fire? I'm shooting fire either way. <laughs> well, what if there's some really expensive papers there and you don't want to shoot fire? Those papers are going to be in flames. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, someone has to stay by the edge to watch him and signal me, and I'm going to step back, and anybody else that wants to help pull can get on there, and we can we can work it. Okay. So I think uh, no real need, I don't think, to lower Nimbus Blue if you're lowering him. And what I'm going to do sure. is I'm going to... Kill you all. Yeah, most likely. I don't. Should I roll a stealth or can, you, can anyone see that map? No. Okay, good. No. Uh, let me zoom out and see if I can. Nope. That's what it looks like inside. Before the he cave. goes over. Good job, uh, Nimbus. Hickaby's gonna. May I forgot my cut. Uh, yeah, don't. Man, the than follow the light of the thunder, and he's gonna do a little guidance on him too. Okay, so I really only want Nimbus to see since he's the only one lo uh, lowered down. So. Um, so we slowly lower Nimbus down. All right, Nimbus. Okay. And uh, then someone's got to like yes. like wave hand signal oh, him. Someone. I in the see one handsome top. creature up there. I, this. A long beard and a hat. That's Ooh. all you see. Sexy. Oh, man. <laughs> so all right, there's there's nothing in the cave. The cave looks empty. Yeah, you see a turn the. So the it, it's it turns away and you and you can only see just sort of around the that just that one little bend you can see sort of uh, that it continues past that. Is this there, is why I didn't want you to get the spell. Does that, uh, give the, is there enough rope that I can walk in here for a little bit? Uh, sure. Yeah. So just say lower me down, lower me down, L lower me down, lower yeah, me plenty down. Plenty of slack. Yeah. Thanks, okay. Thanks to Baloo's planning. And I will. Um, move into the cave. Okay. Do you want to do so stealthily or? Yeah, let me roll a stealth. Okay. I'll give him as much slack as he wants, but then I will, as soon as he, oh, as soon as he says stop the slack, I'm going to turn around and face away from the thing. So if he goes, pull me up, I just run with the rope. Okay. It's 14. Right. 14. I okay. need to make it. See what my guy says. Ooh. <laughs> um, you hear Who's some, that guy tied the ropes? <laughs> you hear some stirring around the corner of the cave. Okay. You know what? Uh, fuck it. I am going to run towards where I hear the stirring. The stirring. Mm -hmm. And just kind of go right to the edge so I can see exactly what's in there. Okay. I'll say you're able to get to about here. And that's what you see. Mm. You see, Gosh. you see this Terra Folk over here, and just ooh, the, there's a Terra Folk. Ooh, just the edge I, of this one over here. It's like fireworks. And All right, I'm I'm lighting I'm lighting them up. I'm using the breath right now, right on this guy. I can see right in front of me. Um, 
You can't, I don't think there's enough. You can get to the guy to your right. Uh, I think it's only, what is it, a 15 foot cone? Yep. Oh, yep. God damn. I should, I should have gotten more detail before I got down. <laughs> all right. Um, you can all right, roast so the I chicken want to, to your right. A, two steps First in yeah. and roast the guy to my left. Okay. And then r- run, use dash, I guess, if I have to, to run all the way back to the opening to get pulled out. Okay. So you, you get to about right here and um, you feel the rope sort of, it, it doesn't stop you, but it's, it's starting because it's wound through the uh, cave to, to tighten up on you. And um, so my guy has to make a, it's Dex, right? Or is it different for the dragon breath? No, it's Dex. Dex, okay. I just threw up the spell card for you. All right, oh, cool. thanks. Under the spell. Use action. 15. 15 and the uh, spell save DC. Would make be... it snarn. What's the DC on it, Snarn? Hmm. San- or, uh, snarn? It would be what a normal DC is. <laughs> so, oh, I it's on your spell page. Yeah. So eight plus your, or you're not a spell. He's not a spell caster though. So right. Snarn is four. No, no, it would be snarn. Not mine. Is what we're saying. It's 14 then. Okay. So he, <laughs> makes, he still takes half damage. So roll some damage. Three D six. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. Uh, I would think it would still be, uh, Still be Snarns because it's Snarns spell technically. That's fine. Either way. All right, Snarn, you want to roll it up or you want me to? It's your action. You roll the three D. All right. Yeah. Oh okay. God, that was hard. You roll a six. <laughs> a six and a two and a two. All right, I pull on yank on the rope and I want to start running back after I've lit him up. Okay, Baloo, you feel a tug like you caught a, a decent large mouth. Okay, here we go. I just start tugging. Uh, oh, yeah, a... I start going. All right, make a strength check. Sure. See how quickly you can get him out of there. I'd like to ready my weapons at this point. Okay, yeah. Uh, you pull him out pretty quick. Good move, yeah. And, uh, well, it's going to be funny because he's going to go faster than it at first, and then he's just going <laughs> to also he's just gonna go, yo. <laughs> yeah. So roll dex check to see if you don't hit, hit your head on the way up. He bang, he bangs yeah. against the wall a little bit, not enough to take any damage, but he scuffs his knee it a little is. bit. And uh, yeah, he's trying to stand up, but you pull him back down to the ground, and he flies out of the cave and drag him across the dirt a few a little bit. Like, <laughs> yeah. Is he up? Is he up? Yeah, oh. <laughs> yeah right. There are th- there are th- a three, possibly four, Petri folk. I burned one. But they should be coming soon. I hope. I'm not going back down there. Well, we may uh, have to if we need to go get them. You hear a loud growl, and Snarn, uh, S- Snarn speaks Draconic. Does anyone else? No. Oh, no. Um, nope. Nope. No. Uh, Snarn, you hear, stay where you are. Protect me. Like, I let everybody we, else. Where did do we hear that from? Uh, yeah, you, where do I hear? You you heard it grumbling. It's like it's like a loud boom, echo, booming out out of the uh, out of the tunnel somewhere in the, out of the cave. Okay, yeah, somewhere in the cave. Sorry, yeah. Okay, I guess we're going down there to get in. So these... is it telling what 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 was it? What happened? There was a growl. What was it? Uh, Snarn, I think you can make a... Um, oh, I don't know. How about a... I think intelligence... Just a straight intelligence check. I guess. Yeah. How about a wisdom insight check? I think that makes more ooh, sense. Ooh, 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 that's a good one. All right.
Mm. Yeah, I don't know. You know that it's <laughs> draconic, uh, but you you don't recognize the voice or so we all stand around looking like all with our weapons pulled. We're waiting and we're waiting and we're waiting. And I go to Snarn, where are these things? Nimbus. What? They, I'm, I'm not kidding. There were three, possibly four of them. I burned one. Go back down and look. <sighs> <sighs> I Five. got you. You no problem. I got you up here. No problem. Go, go, go. I will go. Okay. I'm taking my quarter staff this time, just in case. Don't drop but, it. No, I'm not going to. All right. So I'll slowly lower him down. All right. Just enough so that he can just see past the lip of whatever it is. All right. I'm gonna roll a uh, what is it? A uh, perception. Again. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> just to see what I can see from like before going in. Okay. Fourteen arrows. <laughs> so blue, oh my God. blue dangles you right in front of the cave, and you see a terra folk right in front of you. And uh, uh, hit them, Nimbus! Hit them! <laughs> <laughs> you can you can uh, roll initiative or get pulled back up. Um, you're dangling there right in front of him. Oh, I'm You're getting like, pulled back up. Pull me back <laughs> up now. There is one right in front of me. You're like a goblin pinata. Yeah. Get so, me back up. I, I so, run. Okay, you run. You drag him back up. And uh, I, I, I just put you there just to show you. <laughs> oh, just, I what, trip. <laughs> yes, Baloo trips and uh, the he lets go of the rope and uh, Nimbus falls and uh, before Blue's able to catch the rope again, whoosh, he catches the rope, but you are past the cave. Oh, You're shit. below the cave. All right. Can I grab, am I able to grab like the edge of the cave in the wall to try to just go back in, I guess? Yeah. You, um, you climb back up the rope and as you put your hands on the cave, Fuck. you see the Terra Folk. <laughs> looking down at you face to face. <laughs> He's like, oh, right. shit. Uh, uh, I'll roll initiative. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's that time. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, He's going to... And these are strange creatures. So I think we all need to roll initiative. Right? Yeah, let's all of us roll initiative. and uh, That way we can find out when I can pull again. Yeah, so he's going to... these. You'd think he'd bite you, but he he has a javelin. Actually, he's going to uh, he's going to just take a poke at you with his javelin. Yay! That's not too bad. No, not too bad. Oh, that Sorry, hurts. I, I couldn't use the screen because all I can see is black. So. Oh, okay. I can't put you on there just yet. So, can you open your yeah. character sheet? And... Yeah, I did it. That's oh, why I did. Okay. That's I did it already. I oh, just okay, said it because cool. I know you said you have to do it on the thing to to be able to put it in the tracker. Oh yeah. Um. Yeah 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 yeah. How'd y'all do it? How did everybody else do it then? Click yeah. our token and click initiative. How'd token you action. Token? How'd you Mine is on the screen. The screen is black, but I can see my token. Oh. Yeah. Oh, hey, there is my token. <laughs> okay. I said I, I could see that. a nice looking guy. <laughs> I <laughs> never saw this. Oh, man, but I had a 14. I'll change it. I'll change it. Okay, thanks, sweet. <laughs> yeah, no problem. I had a 17, but I had talked to myself on. <laughs> did you? Oh. Hey, hey, Gary, what was all this stuff up here? You trying to kill us early? Is that what you're doing? Practicing? Where? The, uh, the, the rock range and all this other yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah. I like to daydream. and <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. I can crit these guys. That's so right. awesome. So, okay. So you got stabbed for 10 uh, yes, piercing I... damage. Okay. Um, and it is, well, I guess technically it's Leon's go. If he wants to do something. I can't see a thing. Okay. Um, you can describe to me. We, and I can't put you in the cave just yet since you're not in the cave. So we're going to have to theater of the mind for those who aren't in the cave. So, um, Well, they're just looking over the edge seeing Snarn. The spear is sticking out at Snarn. That's probably what all they would see. Yeah. So so Nimbus is, is trying to climb up into the cave and you see this terrible just jabbing at him with a, a javelin. <laughs> So can I lean over and take a shot with my bow? Uh, yeah, he's got about three quarters cover um, where he is. 
I'll try. Go for it. Just be happy he doesn't have a sword yeah. and just doesn't no. slice the ropes. 23. That's a hit. Yeah, you hit him right in the back of his head. <laughs> Ow! Yeah. Uh, second one missing. Yeah. With the cover. And that's all. Uh... All right. So he pokes his head back up and he and he and he pulls the air out of the back of his his neck head and uh, he throws it off the side of the cliff and runs back inside the cliff. Um, so Nimbus, I guess you can take an attack of opportunity if you can somehow explain how. <laughs> Uh, sorry, I was muted. Um, uh, can I throw a dart at him, or can I? I can't run at him, right? Because it's an attack of opportunity. So you're holding on to the edge of the cliff with both of your hands. Oh, okay. Then I will not do anything. There's nothing I can do except try to climb up. Yeah. No. I'll say you can oh, jump up and 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 uh, and take a reaction if you want to. It was going to be your turn anyway, so yeah. Acrobatics. Use your acrobatics. Oh. Okay. I will, I'll use my acrobatics to try to. You're a monk, man. You're a wow. ninja. Do it. Perfect. Do it. Yeah. And I'll take a hit on. Yeah. Nineteen is a hit All right. for sure. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> He's still up. Yeah, of course. <laughs> is it still my turn or uh -huh. that yeah. was just yeah. Oh wait, okay. I thought I only got that one shot on him. All right. I'll use my second attack. Um Okay. And, That's a hit. and then I'm gonna spend a key point for two bonus action bonus tags that probably doesn't hit that 10 misses the 9 finishes him off 19 finishes him off yeah you crack his skull good and uh he's a nice. huge heap laying in the pile there and uh you hear other creatures um rustling and moving towards you um <laughs> What uh, what do the rest of you want to do? I think we might have ruled initiative a little a little prematurely, but um, we'll see. Terrible. Well, it was just to see like like I needed initiative so I could see when I yeah, pulled up the rope. That's fair. And then, uh, well, well, you guys talk about it. What do you want to do? Quick. Well, yeah. Well, this as far as I'm concerned, he told me to pull him up. I'm going to try and pull him up as soon as I can, unless I get otherwise. So oh, Nimbus okay. has got to Nimbus yeah. has got to decide what he wants to do. Well, he yeah, wants to come so, back up or f defend the the landing point while we try and rappel down. Yeah, that's is. exactly what I was going to suggest. So I kind of go to the edge and I kind of wave for them to come down. Um, and untie your ropes. And, and untie the rope from me. But I want to hold it just in case it'll help someone okay. get down easier. There are some stalactites and stalagmites. You could tie the rope off to one of those. Uh, I will do so. If you wanted to. Okay. I'll just what am I rolling? Uh, anything? No, nah, we'll, we'll make that a free action. While, while you're doing that, the I'll allow the uh, Terra folk to kind of move in a little bit just to sort of counterbalance. Oh, good for them. That's move. good. So now remember, one of you guys, <laughs> one of you guys that's not Nimbus that are looking over the edge needs to let me know what's going on because my initial reaction is I'm as soon as I get up, I'm going to grab the rope and run with Okay. Yeah, so somebody All on right. the surface. I'll, I'll yell back to you. Don't... Uh... Don't run. He wants us to come down. Okay. He's killed one of them already. Do, do, uh, who's good at climbing? It could be in the uh, you're the next in line <laughs> as far as uh, turn order goes, if you wanted to climb first. So I pull up my part of the rope, and he's got the other the that's tied to the tree, tied to the slag mine, so he's, we got that. Mm -hmm. So I toss the rope to Hickaby, and you're going to go? Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay. So you have rope. one rope that's stationary that you can climb down on and one rope that as a safety thing. I guess I'm your belayer. 
Yeah. <laughs> Hickaby, Texas. Uh, Belay, uh, Hickaby. And, uh, Weapons out and swing down. All right. You swing right in. Uh, SWAT raid style. You swing right into the cave. And it's All right. Uh, Precious cargo. Like we coming. Once I feel the tug on the uh, I'm pull it up and give it the snarn, and we'll just keep. You keep give what to snarn? I tie the rope around my rope around snarn. And I push him off the edge. <laughs> 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 Snarn swings into the cave. Uh, ah! he's, like, Wait. <laughs> he's still trying to get an idea of what's going on. And uh, before he knows that he's inside the cave, too. Hello, gentlemen. I believe we're about to have company. Very. So I. Um, and I um, Nimbus. And so I just repeat everything. As long as everyone's willing, I'll just keep lowering him down as a safety net and we'll get. Get him in, there. and then when my when my turn comes, I'll wrap the rope that's around me. I'll wrap that around the tree, and then climb down the rope that's stationary, and get into the end of the the cave. All right, cool. So, how much lighting do we have? Not much. I'm gonna shift click you guys. Do we need light? You are where you are. Can you see? Yep. Okay. I can. Yeah. Yeah. This one's got the um a coin. Yeah, the whatever. The why can't I remember the the dynamic lighting setup. So um it's very dark and it's a windy kind of cave. And uh it's it's that way by design. So what's um No. Where were they? That's weird. Okay. You hear some scrambling in the back. And I think since battle kind of like, like stopped for a second, the one was killed, they sort of repositioned. So let's, let's reroll. I'm going to, let me, um, I'm gonna remove all the turns here and let's reroll initiative. Okay. Hickaby's going to cast light on one of his arrows and get ready to shoot it down in there. Okay. Okay. No, I didn't do too bad. Oh, look at you making me all look bad. <clears throat> I'm very clumsy. <laughs> I'm just so like glad the DM your, is your nice. And, huh? Yeah. I like how that's your main quote. I just like how the GM was really nice and didn't make us do any kind of rolls to get down the ropes into the cave. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you got two. <laughs> I would have been way meter to my players. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. You. That's why I had redundancy up. Just for the yeah, fact that you got oh. Alexadon, you know. Yeah. Um, like, oh, look, you're 750 pounds. The rope snaps. <laughs> <laughs> bye bye. Uh, Hickaby, you are up first. And uh, the dead uh, Terra folk is difficult terrain. Okay. Um, he casts light oh. on his arrow and he's going to shoot it. On the first thing he sees down the tunnel. Right. Those things are pretty help. big, aren't they? Does that help? They are. They're large creatures. And um Blue excuse me, excuse me. Blue yeah. Blue walks up to the front, pushing everybody to the side. Excuse me. He grabs the terra folk with his trunk and just drags it to the edge and bye bye. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, yeah, you'll have to. Well, yeah, okay. everybody squishes around and moves over, and you know they we climb over the body and drag it a little farther, and you know it may take a little longer, but we just okay. get it out of there. All right, fair enough. You get the uh, guy out of there. I'd ah. bury you, but see you. Yeah, he <laughs> cartwheels like a like a helicopter acorn. Thing. <laughs> um, Hickaby. Be free. You, what do you see? I shoot at the first thing I see moving, but I see half of the terror token down here. <laughs> Nimbus Snow. Yeah, I think that, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I get, if you can see it, you can shoot through that tiny little gap. So you hit the terror folk. Uh, okay. And crit him, right? 14. I think I see something moving. Look. <laughs> Yeah, square dead you in the middle. You got this beak. Yeah, you got this beak. 
Yeah, nice shot. And that's my turn. That's it for you? Okay. Yeah. Uh, you hear some rumbling uh, further back in the cave. Sound of a roar. It's like a it's like a guttural deep roar. And it doesn't sound like one of the Terra folk. And These Terra folk sound different. What the <laughs> heck is this? What is going on? Leon. What, what was that thing that spoke earlier? All right. <clears throat> I can't see anything, so I'm going to try and move up. Remember, if you can see them, Dick can see you. What is this? Hey, so that was the air. The arrow had light on it, right? Yeah. So that means there's light in wherever he just shot that arrow. Yeah, I put a couple torches in there anyway. So yeah, perfect. You should be able to. So once you turn the corner, you'll be able to see. I like I, this. So, so literally, it's your token. You can only see from where your token is. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So you guys see like into the, almost into the next room where I can't. That's kind of neat. This is really cool. Uh, May I speak now? <laughs> <laughs> Go for it. <laughs> okay. I'm going to uh, bonus action cast um, whatchamacallit. Hunter's Mark. Whatchamacallit? Yep, Hunter's Mark, Mark on... This guy right here. Okay, he be marked. And then I'm gonna take a shot. Hmm. Oh. Eighteen is a hit. Got two arrows sticking out of him now. And then I'm going to take another shot. Oh, I didn't take off the hunter's mark damage. Uh, so all that. All right. So, okay. Yeah. You take him down. He's, the arrow knocks him off his feet, and he too is a dead Terra folk. And I'll end my turn right there. Okay. <clears throat> uh, to Baxel. Okay. I got to move up some because I can't see shit. Did anyone else see the Black the black Dragon's initiative roll? What the Black? What? <laughs> <laughs> Chicken. Oh, I see it now. I see it now, yeah. but not in character. That was, su- yeah, yeah. that was supposed to be on the GM layer. It's not supposed to be. Yeah, it wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. I can see him, but he's going to have. Oh, where did I start? And that was rough terrain because it was. Okay. So this is it. Um. I guess the one I can s- actually the one I can see best is down. Oh my god, Tabaxel, you have disappeared. I cannot see you anymore. <laughs> uh, uh, whichever one of these, these I can see better, Gary. It looks like I can see this one down here better. I can see like like his whole top. This one over here, I can see about half. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Is that okay? Yeah, you right, see then I'll shoot the one I can actually see. Yeah, and uh, you see him standing next to a pile of what looks to be treasure. Yeah, and I like that. All right. All right, so I'm going to shoot him with my short bow. Wow, that was horrible. That's a miss. Yeah, yeah, it was. <laughs> and, uh, and I've got no movement left to get away from this asshole right next to it. Okay. So, okay, good. My guys are going next. Awesome. All right, that's it. I'm done. Uh, Nimbus. All right. Um, I am going to move down here uh, and go after this guy who I started burning the last time I was here. Yeah, he's still standing. Hello, sir. It's like burnt fur. I think we have some some business that's unfinished, meaning your death. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, 
Uh, all right. So the 11, oops. The 11 is a miss. All right. And um, I'll spend another key oh, point. 25 is a hit, though. All oh, right. Which one's which? Okay, yes. 25. Yes. yes. All right. And for my first bonus action. You kill him. Oh, awesome. All right. So I have another bonus action. Um, and, but I don't, you know what, with that bonus action and hearing that there possibly, maybe could be a young dragon room. No, we don't um, know that. You don't know. Yeah. Um, well. I'm going to use my dart because I really don't have enough movement to go after that guy. And that doesn't even hit anyways. Yeah. Clank, clank. Off the wall. <laughs> And I'm done. Baloo. Um, I guess I am just going to, let's see here. I am here. Use Q. What do you do? You, I forget. You just hold down Q. Yeah, you or, click or, and hold you your token. Click Q. Oh, so you click and hold your token. And move it around a little bit and then hit Q. Hit Q when you change direction. Yeah, there you go. There. It's as far as I can get. I'm not, real axles in my way. I'm not a super stickler about it either, so you can kind of guesstimate. Well, I was trying to... F I, it was hard because the way the map is, it was mm -hmm. hard to count how many squares I could go. So I just wanted to kind of a general idea. And Tabaxel's in my way, so I don't want to step on him. <laughs> I'm way bigger than he is. Uh, Thank you. Yeah, you see nothing but dead Terra folk and Tabaxel, of course. Good uh, job, guys. Well, then I guess I I'll know, move right? Again. Two, three, four, five. All right, double move. All right, you see more Terra folk. At least one of them. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. I bring up my shield. There's one around the corner. To your left, Tabaxel. Um, okay. Snarn, you're up. And I bang my shield with my mace. Like, bring it. All right. I'll start moving around the corner. Oh, I can hear... That's cool, the, the the sound of the, yeah. Well, I don't know if I like that sound. <laughs> <laughs> so I can probably see that guy there then, right? Mm -hmm. You can. Since that's really what I see on my screen. Yep, and you can see it, it you can so see it. I'm going to firebolt that guy. Okay. Fourteen hits. Ooh, nice damage. He's still up there. That's it for me. Okay. Uh, he's kind of standing upright. Looks like he's sort of guarding the treasure here with his uh, jab on his hand. He takes the firebolt and he kind of uh, stumbles back into the wall, but stays where he is. Uh, Terra Folk. Um, Bring it, Big Bird. All right. Let's take a look. <laughs> take a look. Big Bird. 50. Dives. Okay, so I can't dive. Um, this guy will kind of swoop down here. And uh, I think he's going to. Did actually, you lay an egg? <laughs> he's going to try to block the entrance of the tunnel. And uh, he's going to take a swipe at Tabaxel. Several of them. Oh, we, they do bite. That's right. Um, oh, jeez. Sorry, Tabaxel. That's so Yeah. Awesome. 16. <laughs> this is not a yeah. huge amount of damage. Yeah, and I think I have uh, Uncanny Dodge. Okay. Is that for one of those? Uh, it's once, I think it's, yeah, it's a reaction, so one. Right, okay. But I can have one of the. Cool. Okay, so one of those does four. All right. And. Cool. But which one? Let me hear you. Hear I don't one. know. You hear some wings <laughs> flying 
taking off. And uh, this one's going to, he's got to fly 50, so he gets two. Is that adjacent? Yeah, to Baloo. And he's going to try the same thing. To Baloo. Hello. He <laughs> misses with all three attacks. Nothing, yeah. Yeah, you're like, psh, psh, uh, bashing him away with your forearms and your armor. Um, this guy, I'm slice here. We'll fly around. And 50 feet. And he'll give it a try. With enough rolls, you're bound to hit. Yep. Yep, two out of three. 13. Two out of three ain't bad. So that is six. 26. I'm down two. All right. That, I believe, that's there go. Um, Hickaby, you're up. Hickaby is going to take, load his arrow, and he can see, he can see whatever this thing is next to Tabaxel. But, eh, I hate going from the arrow to select. They need to have like Q to where you can move your token and then unclick it. You can do the arrow mm -hmm. instead of clicking around. So I'm gonna squeeze past. Ooh, excuse me, Leo. And I'm gonna try and shoot past my my little buddy. Okay, you're good to go. You don't duck have to Baxel. Shoot. Yeah, to I'm him. probably already ducking. I just got bit and scratched. <laughs> <laughs> and you're short. These things are huge. Um, yeah, I am pretty short. He's gonna Annabelle. Come on, Annabelle, rid us. Mm. Five ten. 22, oh, yeah. Holy 23, shit. Yeah. and sneak attack. God, nice. Yeah, yeah he's dead. Person. <laughs> yeah. 28, okay. He's dead. That's for hurting my friend back to him. Like right through the eye, <laughs> brain out the back of his head. Uh -huh. he just Thanks, dude. And he's going to take a step back, talk another hero. <laughs> yeah. Way to go, Annabelle. All right, Leon. Path's clear up. All right. That's my turn. And uh, Snarn, you hear in Draconic, what is going on? Find out what's happening. And uh, you see this Terra Folk start to move. Maybe Tabaxa does. Maybe Snarn, too. I can't see what y'all can see. Oh, yeah, I see him. Is that a big daddy bird back there? Same as the rest of those. I have never heard this language before. Leon. I didn't realize that, the, that, they, were, that they were so big. They're huge. Yeah. Okay, it's my turn. Your turn. Yes. Okay. Um. So I tell. Uh, can I shoot through everybody at this one? Uh, I don't think you've got what Hickaby's got. I'll have to give. Okay. Him no. Care. I think he's got, uh, what has he got, a, um, something that allows him to ignore cover? Yeah, he ignores cover. So, I mean, you can, but it's going to be probably half. Well, I can move right here and shoot this one, right? Yeah, there you go. Okay, uh, I'll move my hunter's mark to there for my bonus action. Gotcha. And then I'm going to light him up. <laughs> I love its little target. Yeah. <laughs> uh, 12 just hits. Nice. Uh -huh. Was it previously hit? Uh, uh, no, that one was fresh, I think. Let me think. Hold on, I can tell you. It's the one that hit me, so it just showed up. Yeah, no, he was fresh, so. Another 10. 12 hits again, so take 10 damage. Plus the five? 15. Okay, yeah. He's stumbling. <laughs> And the extra, because now you damaged him. <laughs> so does that first what? roll... Yeah, that first roll didn't count. So, yeah, that almost does it. That first uh, Hunter's Mark, I mean. You're good at, you're good at rolling ones, Leon, though. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Any other roll... And that, the extra damage, which is one. <laughs> yeah. Any other roll, uh, he'd, be, he'd be out. But, uh, yeah, he's snarling at you. Tabaxel, you're up. You can move All through right. the... Uh, 
Terra folk if you like, but it's difficult terrain. Stuff, yeah, I already, I already countered it. I was going to take all my movement just to get next to blue over there. And I'm going to, because I'm going to drop my bow and pull out my rapier. And that's the wrong icon. There we go. That's using your brain. Okay. And uh, I'm going to stab the Terra folk right next to us here. Okay. Any damage will do. <clears throat> oh, yeah. You run him through. Yay! And he's dead. Crit. Yeah, fucking A. Uh, and I'll miss the rest of my game, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> so this guy. Uh, yeah, do you that's have it. another move? Oh, okay. So that guy's still. No, I don't. I can, because you can only draw one weapon. Hmm. Okay. Uh, until I get the feet. Oh, right. Right, right. Okay. Uh, Nimbus. Alright. Uh, uh, move. Oh. Right there. And I'll use my two attacks on this guy. That's not going to do anything. Nope. Yeah, 20 hits. And. Oh, I really. Bend the point. Um. Hmm. And I'm going to use him to disengage. Okay. And. Oh, actually, can I add five points to that damage? Because I have Fury of the Small. So I'm actually able to add five points to that. I basically add my level. Okay. Fury of the Small, just like my wife. <laughs> <laughs> um, and, uh, yeah, I'll use my bo I'll use Disengage because I have Nimble Escape. Um, and I will go over here. Gotcha. And that's it. All right. Uh, he is still up. Mr. Blue. Torm. Click your character. There you go. Torm, guide to my hand. And I cast... Where is it? A stick of flame on the one in front of me. Ooh. All right. Dex. Dex. Come on, Dex. Oh, he fails. Yes. And perishes. Bless Torm. Move this guy over here. Just for... And then I'm going to move... There. All right. I'm just going to stack these guys. Get them out of my way. Just pretend there's dead terror folk everywhere. Um, My feet are so sticky. <laughs> it's terror fill floor. Eh? Uh, Snarn, you're up. I guess I can still see that guy and he's still up, so I'll firebolt him again. All right. I have no idea who that guy you keep referring to is, but <laughs> <laughs> I'm good to know there's another person. That's a hit. He's dead. I'll just stay back here for now. All right. Lady Boo Boo would be very happy we are cleaning these people <laughs> out. Maybe she'll fix our boo boos. Uh, Terra Folk. Um, he will move to here. You can't see him. I don't think you can. They're running away. I saw him ride. He ran away. Hickaby? Do we want to go right or left? Out of the way, I'm missing all the fun. And I can't get my last one to show up. Okay. Squeeze. And make that. Nope. It's a tight fit, so I won't be able to make very far. All right. And. Well, what in Sam hell? These things are everywhere. Blue, move them out of the way. And I'm going to try and double move. Like, roll over the body right here. And I'll probably <laughs> Combat collapse right next. <laughs> yeah. So, let's double movement. 
kind of leap up on the body and then roll off. Ugh. Hey. <laughs> hey. 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 What? It's hey. Uh. <laughs> and so Blue does his uh, Bo Duke over the front of the General Lee. And. <laughs> uh, yeah, there's that. Did we get that big daddy one? Big bird? No, we have not heard the seen the one that mixed the loud, weird language. All right. Keep your eyes open. And that's the end of my turn. All right. So just then, as you say that, Blue. Oh, I don't want to see it. A black dragon emerges from around the corner. I don't believe in black dragons. <laughs> Oh, oh crap! So, so this is just. A I'm going to be on fire of your imagination. Uh, the black dragon <laughs> sniffs, <laughs> and then just uh, shoots a glut of. I'm on a yeah. token page. And please, and it's going to be a dex check, and I'm screwed. <laughs> yep. Oh, what happened to my acid breath? Did it not go off? Damn. Oh, it went 55 off. damage. I saw it. It uh, did. It went off. Oh. And I'm screwed. I think the damage is broken on it, Gary. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's right. 11 d Um. So, make a deck save. There you go. Now I just saw it. Okay. <laughs> oh! So close. That wasn't going to happen. Shoot. You, sir, are unconscious. And the dragon. Let's uh, hope that doesn't regenerate, boys. Because he just wasted it on me. Finish his move. Actually, he's going to tuck back in here. I think that thing just threw up on Baloo. And uh, you hear him say, guard the treasure with your life. That's, that's his, what we were doing. That's his game. <laughs> and Leon. You just saw a huge dragon <laughs> stomp out. Uh, breathe acid on Baloo, who went down. What do you do? Um, I, I walked down to here, and I was like, uh, where did he go? Tabaxo that. Which way did he go? Uh, he tucked back in the in the cave. He's back there somewhere. I oh, to the so right. Mm. Was was that a dragon? Yeah, yeah, it was a dragon, a black one. Well, we. we she didn't say kill a dragon. She simply said to kill the petri folk. We did that so we could leave. No, I knew that squirrely one left. Mm. Um. I don't think I can make it to Baloo, so I'll probably... I can. Hang there. And I'll keep an action ready. Okay. What uh, action are you holding? Um, a bow shot. To any uh, hostile creature that comes out, kind of thing? Um, yes. To Baxel. All An right, evil got... worm crosses the path. You should. <laughs> Purple worm. <laughs> no, I, I mean, I get it. You just gotta okay. t- tell me what the action is. I'm holding it for a little. I'll, I'll run past. Uh, I'll just say, keep me covered. And I'm going to run over here and I'm going to put my health potion and pour, pour it down up or his trunk or wherever the hell I see him drink stuff. <laughs> yeah. Just where he goes. My mouth. <laughs> no, okay. Right in his butt. <laughs> yeah, it's a suppository healing potion. It might work faster that way. <laughs> hey, um, cool. that's how vodka works. I don't know. Two day four plus three, right? Uh, yeah, it's a regular. Yeah, Is it, no, two day four plus two. Mm-hmm. Two. That's right. Two. Roll, roll good. 
Oh, you, oh, I thought you were going to roll. <laughs> I can roll. We're all, we're all waiting I was waiting for, for the roll. <laughs> I figured you would do it since you were pouring. Like, no, I'll blue, you roll. No. I thought you guys yeah, were just okay. pausing for effect. <laughs> so, nine points. Nine points. That's some good That's dice. That's a good one. Yeah. yeah. Whoa, oh, my God. Did you see that? Yeah, I saw that. We need to get the fuck out of here. Uh... I do not know what that is. It's just a big lizard that talks. <laughs> Spits acid. What happened? You got Aeofeld. Volo's <laughs> book will tell you that is a dragon. We have to get out of here immediately. Indeed. You do you do recognize, I think maybe that it's not as big as the tales of dragons you've heard of before. I think we can take it. <laughs> it killed you in one shot. <laughs> it, it can't do that all the time. You don't know that? What do you know about dragons? You don't even believe in black dragons. Just, dragons I, just, I hope it can do that all the time. <laughs> <laughs> yes. it's, been, it's been roaring at us. Has it been trying to communicate with us? If it, wants, any... if it wants to be... But look at all the treasure. I don't want to die. What would <laughs> Volo do? <laughs> Volo would... <laughs> All right. he, he probably would have been like... Nana and sent people in here. Like she did. <laughs> I don't know. I go with the group. So you tell me what you want to do. Make the decision, Nimbus. You're up. Um, all right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna come over here to Mr. Over by Mr. Blue, just so I can also get a look. Of, holy shit, that's a lot of treasure. Yeah, um, no, that's what makes me want to stay. Yeah, I would. TPK. Um, <laughs> no, no. TPK. I would save unless someone can. I would say we have to leave because even if this dragon had not tended to attack us, we just killed everyone that was here protecting it. I think there's one Terra folk down there. See him? There you see. Him. Yes, but there's one dragon. <laughs> At least, even if it's a, a a young dragon, even if it's not fully grown, it kills you with one shot. Lucky shot. <laughs> I, I think it's lucky enough to kill a few of us. I just can't get out of the way very well. Well, then let's go. If you don't want to fight it, well, I don't fight it's it. It's not up to me. This is a committee of some sort. So who, who, what does everybody else want to do? Mr. Snan, what about you? While you guys are talking, you hear a rumbling and some movement. Well, we need to decide quick, or we do it. we're going to be fighting it whether yeah. we want to or not. <laughs> I'm torn. I'm torn, really. I'm 50-50. Like, I want to get that treasure, but I don't want to die. What are we going <laughs> to do with the treasure? We're looking, f we're searching for cure. We can't carry all that treasure around. Well, we can carry some of it. Are we still in initiative? <laughs> yeah, Nimbus, you're up. Oh. I'm sure your backup character will be happy to spend it. I was going to move. Yeah. I, if you guys all want to do it, I'll, I'll, Nimbus will stay. So it's up to the group. So what's the vote, real quick? Because this thing is going to kill us. Oh, it's That's, tough, man. Dragons are I just know. pure, like tough. They're like the epitome of the monsters now. They're not like back in you know back in the day when you could go kill small ones easy. Uh, it's it, it. There's a good chance some of us will die if we fight it. So if we don't want, if none of us want to. None of us want to die, then we need to leave. If some of us are willing to die, then we stay in. And we can come back later. And we can come back later. He might not be here anymore, which, because right. if I was a black dragon, I'd be gone. All my shit be packed up and say, let's get the F out. I didn't think I mean, I'm willing later. to take that risk if you guys want. I mean, I don't mind. So <laughs> it's up to you guys. You I'm, I'm good climb. with my backup character. If you need still be. have to climb down in Bala, too. <laughs> I don't think it's a good idea, guys. I don't know. Yeah, and that, you know, I think we should just go. All right, we start backing out. Okay. All right. I pick up my bow on the way out. Mr. Dragon, we are leaving. We are leaving. <laughs> All right. We just I wanted to get you... rid of your terror folk. 
understand it's the car. It smelled bad anyway. I hope you can clean your place. This We're was, going home. This okay. was a mistake. We were given poor information. All right. So you begin to move out. I'm going to heal myself on the way out. Okay. Well, let's 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 slow it down a piece. <laughs> oh great! Like six seconds. Can so I have six seconds? To you can have six seconds, spell? and he can move in six <laughs> seconds. So. Uh, I have a feeling yeah, that we want to leave. I just don't want nine hit points. <laughs> Two. So. Not that he can't he, do that much. He hears much. you guys leaving, and uh, he's not happy about that. Doesn't want you to, and uh, he's going to come chase you as you try to depart to here oh boy so blues healed himself snarn what would you like to do what a shitty roll that is <laughs> what should i do hey calm down there guy calm down there we're not here for you really we're not what are you what I cast? Healing word? Um, oh, that's yeah. not what I wanted. I'm sorry. That was the wrong one. It was supposed to be cure wounds. Do you want to make <laughs> a persuasion check? And I want to do a deception. Deception. Oh, oh sure. so you are. Okay. So it's Draconian is Canadian. Is Hold on there, <laughs> guy. Wait just one <laughs> Oh, bud. Oh, what are you doing there, fella? We're all getting out of here. <laughs> I think that's Don't me. you know. Yeah. It's actually three higher than that. Four three higher than that. Yeah, he's not buying it. He, yeah, he he has a murderous uh, look in his eyes. It doesn't seem. We're not gonna come back with it. more friends. <laughs> All right, let's see here. So I'll give you that for free if you want to take an action. I would have moved over to here at least. <laughs> Snarn's like, yeah, for my next impression, Jesse Owen. <laughs> Snarn, get over here and. Cast a spell at it. Oh. All right. I get about the cave entrance. Okay. He's like, I'm out. <laughs> I'm surprised you're not worshipping it. It's like, oh, mommy's here. No, no, it's a black dragon. I don't like black dragons. Uh, this one's going to tear a focal fly around the corner. This one will. Oh, shit. It's more. <laughs> fly to here. I thought all these things were dead. Oh no! Uh, these two are gonna. You misjudged this, Bradley. <laughs> Twelve at Nimbus as a miss, and this one's going to. Do catch it and throw it back. You can, right? If you want to. Spend well, no. Deep well, on, right? I can. I can deflect miss. Um, when I'm hit by a ranged attack, I've been waiting to get uh... hit to use it. I haven't been hit, oh. so don't don't drink me. Okay. I didn't realize you had to get hit. I thought you could just catch them and throw them. Right. No, well, basically, I have to. I catch it and then I roll to reduce the damage. And if I reduce the damage to zero, then I can spend a key. And uh... oh, that's so freaking cool! I got to play one. Hickaby. So Hickaby, you take ten piercing as this uh, terror folk. <laughs> can you catch to Hickaby's and send him back? <laughs> <laughs> I cannot. <laughs> Oh, it's in the bone. It's in the bone. <laughs> uh, and you're up. It could be. Um, Hickamy is going to pull the javelin out. <laughs> and Run away. Good idea. Take a shot at the. Oh, and he sees everyone fleeing the cave, I guess. He's going to take a shot at this uh, terror folk coming up. Eat damn birds. Eat bird food. <laughs> and I'll take a good shot at him. The good news. And I'm going to do free frightening attack. Missing. All right. So he's got a DC wisdom save 14. All right. After he takes Eight damage. 11 damage. 11 damage. Okay. He fails. And frightened and... I'm scared. He's Take scared. that, you overgrown is that, chicken. Is that like disadvantage on all your attacks or something? I forget what it's it disadvantage on its attacks and it can't move closer to me. Yeah. All right. And so I'm going back here. <laughs> and it's Hickabees. Heading for the heels. Okay. 
Mr. Young Black Dragon is going to hop up here and what is he speaking? Just Draconic? Oh, come on. He's got to have, you can yeah. make him have common. common. You're the boss. Oh, God. And he looks down at you guys. <laughs> Not so fast. And uh, he takes a swipe at uh, Tabaxel and Nimbus. I think it's a multi attack. Bring it on. So, let me. <sighs> TPK! <laughs> <laughs> All right, nope, Snart's getting away. Until he, he's going to be up on the top running. And First the dragon's one, just going to swoop down and chomp him. He's going to take a bite at uh, Tabaxel and two swipes of his claws at Nimbus. So here we go. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh! <laughs> you mother. Oh, okay. shit. Hey. <laughs> 19, 27. Ridiculous. 26. Shit. Yeah. Tabaxel goes down. <laughs> Uh, unless you can uncanny, da- uncanny dodge. Yeah, I can uncanny dodge and cut in half. So what is it, 36? Yeah. It's 24 plus 12 is 36, yeah. Four, seven. So 18. You're not down. And then... Nope. I'm close to down. Yeah, I'm down to seven. So Okay. Let's just go. We this will be this. much faster when we leave, sir. Leave. <laughs> <laughs> The problem what is, we, is you're going to promote an attack opportunity. What are we going to do when we get outside? Are we like, oh, got to jump or climb? I have, I climb. have a reaction. Hold on. You can't jump. I mean, you can't jump. Where are you going to go? Yeah, you got to You got to think. He's he's uh, he's not on your trail. He's not. He may not stop at the <laughs> at the is that uh, it? edge of the cave. No. Well, he might There's fly out and attack he us. Might not can he even fit through that? Yeah, he can squeeze through there. That's how he got in. So are we gonna Dog. fight this guy or run and try and climb and get? We got. I would say we have to run. I mean, how are we gonna I'm climb on... while he's raping us from behind? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> I don't think that's one of his attacks. R a k e. I hope. I yes, rake us from behind. I thought you said something else. <laughs> okay, I need. Can I take I'll this reaction, skirmisher? Oh yeah. Sorry, I didn't. I just wanted to make sure before I actually do it. What do I you can't do? believe you all picked classes that are like super yeah, like weak, like uh, like something. armor class low. Okay, gotcha. <laughs> like all we're all ranged and I'm like, yeah, but I can tank. I can disengage without an issue, so that's not yeah. a problem. Yeah, everybody can. Okay. But it's just funny. It's like we don't have a tank. We can't fight a dragon. <laughs> <laughs> I have a fighter wearing medium armor. My AC still fifteen. Well, yeah. you're our tank and you got taken out in the first hit so uh, that didn't promote a lot of confidence dra- in the round. <laughs> dra- dragon breath is not nothing to be sneezed at I rolled a 27 and two 26s it don't matter <laughs> alright and we haven't had that much armor right about Both. now Snarn mm-hmm. you see swing into the cave behind you Ugh. one artist ember yes and one dragon bait Fuck yeah. Really? Yes, sir. That's interesting. Don't go in there, guys. There's a dragon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's a dragon in here. You shouldn't come in here. Or six. <laughs> he takes he takes the glove off his hand and you can see like frost crystals come off his ring of winter and he says, That's why we're here. He's so awesome. I wish I could hear Good him. Good luck to you guys. I'm out of here. <laughs> Damn it. There. Follow him in. You got you got you got things in the way now. You got tanks. All right, so I'm gonna put him. Who just went uh, to Baxel, I think, right? No, nope. no, no, it's Leon's turn. It was Leon's, Leon's turn. turn. So now it's Tabaxel's turn. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna put them after. Well, I don't know. Artis Simbers in here, so really, I just, I'm gonna throw a dagger at the dragon and keep moving out. All right. No, actually, um, yeah, I'll throw to the dragon. Yeah. Is that it? Um, Did y'all skip me? No, oh, Leon Ooh. never got to go. Okay, yeah, Leon didn't go. Oh, my bad. I'll just oh, save that roll for my turn. turn here. <laughs> so, um, did you say somebody came in the cave? Okay, so he's going to help us, I guess. You don't know um, this. 
Okay, know. that's true. Well, he will when he runs around the corner. <laughs> yeah. Right. Oh, we're going to get out of here. What are you doing here? Shit. All right, so I'm going to try and book out. Yeah. Um, and they're like, where are you going? We're here to fight. I'm going to be like, uh, there's a dragon uh, acid upon all of us. I think we should leave. Do I? Can I hear that now? Yeah. Um, uh, and, f- um, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to, that's my movement, and I'm oh, going to yeah, drop yeah, into yeah. my shell. Okay. <laughs> I love He'll that. never find me in here. That's, that's a badass move. And if I can't see, if I can't see it, it can't see me, right? That's not the plan. And Tabaxel, your dagger okay. hits. Uh, he's got an 18 AC, so not too bad, actually. Cool. There's that. Okay. And Doesn't have a ton of hit points either, really. Right there. Boom. Oh, shit. Yeah. Nice. You like that shit? 19 points of damage. Is he dead? <laughs> almost, almost. Wait, wait, wait! You forgot to ask for that little spot that's missing the, the scales, so that he can. Right? Yeah. Where's that? We need that dragon slaying arrow too. Where the hell is that? Yeah, he um, <laughs> All right. he is still in triple digits, but just barely. Hey, Artis is here. Yeah. And dragon bait. Artis comes running past you. Uh, pulls his bow while he's running, and uh, stops here. I'll pick up my bow while I'm here. Blue. Let's get this thing. And uh, he takes some shots. Wait a minute. You <laughs> ran into a zombie T-Rex, but you charge <laughs> a black dragon? He looks at you and uh, gives you a wink and says, dragons are my specialty. And uh, Okay. Apparently goblin tribes weren't. Neither <laughs> are zombies. He mm. fires three so glad times. we found your specialty, sir. <laughs> and and uh, Zimtarum. <laughs> The thugs were going the wrong way. One of the dragons in here and he got sick all over Baloo. <laughs> oh, all right. So he hits the uh, dragon and brings him into uh, mor- the mortal realm of double digits. Um, okay, dragon. let's do the dragon bait. It's going to charge. To he's going to rush up to here. Oh, he can't quite. I'll just say. He's close enough. Two and five reach. Yeah, he's good enough, I think. And because uh, the dragon's sort of there too. All right, so yeah, I'm just gonna have him take a couple of swipes with his holy avenger. Yeah. Um, hit and hit. Twenty six damage. The dragon screams, Roar! and uh, he kind of stumbles back a little bit off the edge of the cliff trying to keep his feet on the back of it um nimbus i don't know where you are i am right here but oh, i will are. soon be oh, shit. but i will soon be are. over here oh wait hold on. nimbus killed the terra folk hold on a second oh god this just went crazy all right five, 10 15 I'm going to go right here. And as I run by uh, artists, I just go, they're all yours. Feel free. <laughs> Nimbus killed a terrafolk. <laughs> yeah. Later, if we all. And uh, that will that will be it. You must have faith in Torm. Mm, I don't have any faith in the two people who just entered the cave. That's the problem. <laughs> Uh, Do you have, if you have faith token, in me, yeah. or, look, or the map? Look at look at him, like he's all over the place. Yeah, I can't. It's, it's like those there. things you shoot at the fair. It goes ding, keeps turning around, ding, turns around, ding, turns around. Baloo. Okay, so I move to here. Good, that still gives me space, and I do Torm. Embolden us. And I have 25 hit points to spread. Nice. I give myself 10. And I give 
15 to, uh, wait a minute. Let's see. Can't see. Get out of the way. Nimbus, I, Nimbus, can you move yourself so I can see your bar? I'll move. I got you. Oh, yeah, I, I, don't have know. I, have, I, I have seven. Have points you? you have, have seven, seven points. Okay, so I'm gonna give uh, I'm gonna give half and half to each you. So I'll give you eight, and Tabaxel seven. Well, remember he he could he has to get up close and attack. I can sh- sit back here and shoot arrows. Yeah, okay, so, so then I'll but give it all to Nimbus. Oh, you don't have to even do that because I'm not getting back in and fighting these. <laughs> Dragon bait and art artists can, can do it all. Uh, so you do what you got to do. I'm good. Okay, no, I'll you take do what you want. Time. But this is what Din- he has faith in you. So. So the player might not have faith in you, but <laughs> I need. Right. And I'll be like, I, I will be like, Nimbus, I need you, and I give you all fifteen hit points, and then I move to here. <laughs> oh and, shit! You're just guilting me. <laughs> and then uh, that was channel. That was my bonus action, and as my main action, I cast. I think as an act, isn't uh, Channel Divinity an action? Uh, Oh, no, it is an action. So I have a bonus action. Uh, But I think uh, Spirit Guardians is a bonus action. Mm -hmm. No, it's one action. Spiritual weapon. Uh, They cast weighted attacks on a bonus action. Oh. I'm sorry, what? I think it attacks as a bonus action. Spiritual weapon is just a bonus action, I think. Yeah. Let me just see here. Yeah, it's just a bonus action. And it also attacks on the first round. So I am... Just a... So then I am, go- I am going to do this. I think you said Guardians. Thanks. Hmm. I'm going to... Uh, I'm just going to... I don't know what I'm going to do now. I thought that was a bonus set. Kick it. I could just hit it, but that's no fun. Um, I'm going to cast Shield of Faith on myself. That is a bonus action. Boom. There we go. So now I have a 20 AC instead of a 10. Or an eight, uh, 18. Kill it. Um, Snarn, your brave friends are fighting a dragon in the cave. <laughs> your brave friend. Yeah, I'll uh, <laughs> All right. Thorm shall smite this evil. We give you a chance, beast. Now you are done. I think you can get just past Nimbus. Claw, claw, bite for, for if you want to. For uh, yeah, I can get to there. Claw, claw, bite for uh, Baloo, and he's done. <laughs> Hey, we'll see. Maybe, maybe Miss Boo Boo will uh, bring you back from the dead. I will firebolt one of the uh, terra folk. I think. Okay. That guy there, I guess. Okay. He's unwounded. That one's wounded? It is. Well, then I'll do that one. All right. And I like that little torch is stuck on the other one. Oh, crit. Okay, so... Let me see. Fear. Do you have... It doesn't matter. It was crit. All right. He's dead. He's no, he's no longer wounded. Yeah. It's a moot point because he is a dead Terra folk. Excellent. That's for me. All right. Um, the this terra folk will start to back away, and uh, he's afraid. It looks like, and he's going to fling a javelin towards Dragonbait. Hey, wait a minute. What do we smell from Dragonbait? Do we get ham? Yeah, strong ham. Mm. That's why I'm fighting because I'm hungry now. <laughs> Yeah, he's carrying a pocket full of ham sandwiches. Um, that's his go. He missed. Crit missed. Hickaby, you are 
He shot himself in the foot. Everybody started to run out of the cave, and then Artis and Dragon Bait ran in, and you guys, looks like, uh, might be running back in. I don't know. What do you want to do? Oh, well, we're all in a nice line for Dragon Bait. Guess we're going back in. <laughs> I called for my yes. spot. I had that good spot. And Just what I was thinking. One, two. Pop around the corner. And I see Blue's up here now fighting the dragon. I got you, Blue. I'm going to. The thunder and guide your arrows. <laughs> and first I'm going to cast a spell. Oh, dear my. Uh, just scared the shit out of me. <laughs> <laughs> Let the ender guide us through this time. So I'm gonna cast this. Uh, one, two, and the next person who's in here, I can see Snarn. All oh. three of us got bless. Let the ender bless us. So every attack, skill, well, attack and save, we get a D4. Cool. So you wanna mark your turkey to... somehow? Yeah, I'll put it up after I at the end of my turn. And I'm going to take a shot. What do you use for this? And shot. Why didn't it go off? There it goes. And I'm going to precision attack. Well, that's 18 plus. I just have this macro so far. 22. Does 22 hit the dragon? Yes, it does. Cool. And so 32. Or 33, 39, and his next turn attack. 43. 42, damn. 42. Holy shit. Nice shooting. Yeah. Wow. The awesome. dragon actually kind of stumbles, and its claws rake on the... Uh, knock some of the hay off, and it's bleeding profusely. And I took 10 points of damage, so I'm going to second wind. Get eight back. That's the end of my turn. Okay. It's almost too fun. I love that. The um, the dragon uh, sees you all pretty much lined up here, and he's going to. Well, we'll see what. See if he regains his breath. He checks himself. Okay. Five or six. Come on. No, no, six. no, guys. Oh no. He oh, thank goodness. <laughs> Uh, he's going to insinuate himself in between you two, though. And uh, he's going to take a bite at Dragon Bait and two swipes of his claws at Blue. Roll bad. He misses you. He does hit Dragon Bait. 22 damage. Whoa. <clears throat> hit the wrong button. And he will finish his move. He will uh, provoke opportunity attacks from you two if you'd like to. And sit here. Dragon Bait's going to take, it's just going to be the, the first attack. Oh, yeah, baby. So, yeah, okay. And blue, if you'd like to. Oh, you did. 21. I did. Gotcha. Points. All right. And that's his go. Leon. All right. Um, look. <laughs> He's a whole wine I, I take a bonus action and pop out my shell. Okay. I'm like, okay. what's going on? Oh, okay. <laughs> um, Freaking crazy ass motherfuckers. Why are we here? <laughs> Can I hit the dragon from right there? I think you got room? too many people in front of you. Unless unless you can, I don't know, jump in the air and shoot over them. <laughs> I don't know, he's pretty tall, actually, so I think you could probably take a pop shot at his head. Yeah. Yeah, or you could you can move into the room because you can move through people, no problem. That's I true. Can see him from there. You could see mm -hmm. him, but you got all these people in front of you, so. But I could shoot over him, right? They'll, yeah, but he'll just get a he'll get a bonus on his AC. So 
So how about right there? Same thing. Is that the way out, Beast? Is that why you're going that way? I think he wants to line me up for like acid breath, breath of his mouth. No, it's um, up to you. I mean, it's risk reward. I mean, you can take a shot from way from behind four or five people, but he's going to get a little bit of cover because. Or of you it. could almost. Or you could run in the it. room and and he'll yeah. you know face the danger of the dragon and take a regular shot. It's up to you. Do it. Do it. Well, no, I'm not going to take an opportunity attack. So I'll just take a. You do attack. what the character would do. End of story. Exactly. <clears throat> He goes back in the shell. No, like he's not a Freddy cat. Just... <laughs> we were running. All right, I'm going to take a shot. All right. Okay. okay. It's a, yeah, it's it's a move point. You hit him. So 18. All right. <laughs> and then I'll take another shot. <laughs> The dragons are like, I'm intelligent. Why was I? Why did I come out and attack him? I really didn't think. And I just like this four in that one. So 22 all together, and then, then I'll move out of line. Now. Okay. So I'm not lined up. Smart. Tabaxel. All right. Uh, I'm going to shoot an arrow from here, and I'll get the bonus. I get. Okay. So, okay. 23. All right, even with it, it's a hit. Bitching. There goes seven. And 11, 18. Okay. Nice. And then I, too, am going to jump around this corner. Yeah. Artist. And I'm done. Okay. Artist is going to cast a spell. Kill Dragon. Love that spell. Yeah, right. He is going to try to turn this wow. dragon ice. That is crazy. The dragon fails. Huh. Uh, the dragon is restrained, and you see ice crystals form all over the dragon. And it is restrained. What's restrained mean? Restrained means speed zero, disadvantage on dex, saves, attacks, and attackers have advantage on saves. Nice. So he has a small casing of ice surrounding him. Uh, Dragon bait sees this, leaps off the edge with the Holy Avenger, and takes an attack. <clears throat> it hits. He's still up, though. Barely. Nimbus. Yeah, the dragon's frozen in place. All right. Um, I, Nimbus is going to come down here feeling guilty for <clears throat> from Blue uh, trying to inspire him. <laughs> And he's going to take uh, two attacks on the dragon. Okay. That's a miss. And a miss. <laughs> All right. And he's going to use, I'm going to use my bonus action to uh, disengage and go right back up here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so I just, he just ran over, looks at Baloo, takes two hits at the dragon, doesn't hit, and then just turns around and just runs back. Baloo winks at him. Yeah, I think they were sort of half-hearted. You hit him in the his, his, his thick hide and it just doesn't damage him. Baloo, you're up. Okay. Uh, hold on one second. The dragon's furious. It's You see the acid I dripping out of its mouth. I don't care. I go there and I cast... Spirit Guardians. All right. So on his turn. Right. And then that is a. That's just a regular action, I think. Yeah, one action. And then as a bonus action, Starts I will. 
Uh, that also, st I'm down to 18 again, so. Okay. And then uh, as a Rick, as a bonus, I don't know. I really wish they had like, like next to the thing, a B mm. or something. So I can see bonus action. They have like, they have like casting times, but they don't have like, I, they have concentration, but they don't have uh, mm. mm -hmm. like bonus action or regular action. You can go in and up update it. It's a pain in the ass, but you can do it. Yeah. I'm good. I think that's all I can do anyway. All right. Snarn. I think I will just uh, firebolt the dragon. Okay. So 16. 18. Plus 2, 18. Okay. You hit the dragon. And... The dragon reels and falls dead. Falls towards our December, who jumps and rolls out of the way. Ah! Oh, the waste of spell. Yeah. The tail, <laughs> smack, the tail smacks Hickaby in the ass as it uh, finally does its thing. Woo! All right, on um, first date. <laughs> All right, reflex. This Get the Terra Folk. This Terra Folk takes off into the back and uh, you hear some scrambling up some rocks and there's some tunnel or chimney or something in the back that you didn't see or couldn't see and uh, you, the sound disappears the battle is done I turn and slap uh, dragon bait on the shoulder and go <laughs> it's about time you came to our rescue <laughs> he uh, you get the sense of brim brimstone no what is it? Uh, hickory smoke. Uh, it's a sense of aiding friends on a quest or doing things for friends in battle. And then I, uh, I sit down and start casting prayer of healing, and I say, "Everyone gather." <laughs> Takes ten minutes. Okay. You guys do that. Artist sits down, puts his glove back on, and. Uh, and he, and he comes over to Blue. He's like, I told you dragons were my specialty. That is impressive, my friend. Yeah, thank you. And he uh, puts his bow back on his back. So you're roaming around the jungle to kill this dragon? Not Probably not just this one. Not is the there a dragon, dragon infestation? No. Uh, I have never seen such a beast. I bet this thing would make some great boots. There used to be many more dragons in Cholt, but uh, not so much these days. Now it's all the nasty undead. Ugh. Well, well, I, well, I definitely appreciate your intervention. Yes, thank you for coming to our rescue. And thank you, Tabaxo, for your timely, uh, uh, your timely help in getting me back up to my feet. I'm pretty sure everybody takes 20, uh, gets 22 points hit, hit points back, but I have to look to see if make sure there was a not the amount of people. Okay. Of yeah. Artist says, uh, uh, you know, you're, you're welcome, and I think I still maybe owe you one. So six creatures. So, so everybody that's probably hurt. Uh, were uh, dragon bait and what's his name hurt? Nope. Uh, Dragon okay. Bait was a little bit, but he's fine. He's got a ton of hit points. Well, I mean, I don't think six of us were hurt, so. Oh, I see. Okay. I only need, I technically only need a little bit, so if I can forego it, I only have, I'm only down two hit points, but if I'm extra. So everybody gets 22 hit points back that was hurt, and then I, and does that, and so everybody else is good, and I'm going to just put myself back up two, because that's, makes sense. So Dragon Bait's uh, How did you know there was the a... Sword. How did you know there was a dragon in this place? I heard the commotion. Nanny Poopoo wanted us, us to stay with her, and to be honest with you, Dragon Bait and I were kind of going to shove off. Mm. But uh, oh, that's right. We, uh, oh, did you hear it speaking? We heard the growl. I didn't hear any speaking, but uh, we could hear the battle for sure. I recognize the dragon, so I thought you might need a little help so I suppose we should check to make sure everything else is gone okay save you some trouble there's uh you search around everything's gone 
pretty much just a sleeping area. The, and Tamaxel has made his way over to the treasure, and there is quite a horde of, uh, of items. A lot of broken like art pieces, um, things like that. Um, but among the treasure, you find... I have the group loot open. One potion of healing. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Uh, so it's a dragon horde. Quite a bit of things, actually. Nice. Um, we should skin up this dragon, too. Scattered about about a thousand copper pieces. Wow. 300 silver. Or 300 silver. Okay. 150 gold. 50 gold. Five rubies worth 50 gold a piece. Times 50 GP. Okay. Six. Six sapphires worth forty Six. apiece. You said forty. Forty gold apiece, right? Okay. And there are several items. Uh, one of which is an immovable rod. Oh. And what is it? An immovable, I'm sorry, immovable, immovable rod. rod. Oh, okay. they're, they're awesome. <laughs> yeah, they're like one of the best items ever, and we wouldn't need it of a tree up there. Can we move it, or is it stuck there? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you just click just, a button. We just gonna look at it. <laughs> um, Fair. Point. That's what keeps it. Remember that island we saw floating? That's what keeps it up in the sky. That's right. <laughs> yeah. So no, and 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 this is assuming you guys spent some time to review, and we'll dispense yeah. with our kind of checks. But um, sending stones too. Oh. Yeah. We can communicate. Yeah, not not the group walkie talkies like we had in TMM. Unfortunately. Yeah, just the two. That's right. Um, one potion of superior healing. Goggles of the night, of night. Ooh. And finally, gauntlets of ogre power. So, um, do you gentlemen require any of this treasure? Before we... as I'm talking to Dragon Bait and the other guy. No, the artist is, is uh, you know, he, he's, he pats, his, pats his bookmark and uh, he holds up his ring. Dragon Bait is cleaning his, whole, his plus three Holy Avenger. And he's like, no, we're not really in it for the money. Do you need a uh, perhaps a souvenir as I point to the body? <laughs> nah. As I assume, like one of our ranger people is dissecting wholeheartedly. Yeah, it's not. Yeah, I'll assist if we want to skin it up. All right. Yeah. I want to watch that. Make a survival right. survival check. Skin this guy. I'll help him. Yeah. So you can assist. Mm. To go with advantage, I guess. He's sure. very proficient in survival. Yeah, you roll with advantage. With the help. Who's scanning it? Leon? I thought you were. I was helping. Oh. So I thought you were. Okay, I'll do it. That tail meat looks awfully tasty. With advantage. Oh, it rolls advantage automatically now, right? Okay. 28. Oh, that's stealth. Hold on. <laughs> survival. Yeah, just as good. Okay. Yeah. Well, you snuck in. You 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 did that so quick. We didn't even notice. Yeah. Yeah. You guys didn't even see me. Carved it up. It's because I'm because I'm the same color as the dragon. He crawls. What he did is he made a slit and he crawled inside and just did everything. And next thing you know, he came out and he just folds it up and puts it in his. <laughs> <laughs> so what do, you, what are what do you calling that there, GM? Um, let's say you're able to get. Uh, I'll say six of the dragon teeth. That uh, that are intact, uh, and not damaged or corroded by its own acid. I'll put perfect. Yeah, you also get enough uh, dragon hide. You think to probably, if you if you took it somewhere, it could probably make a suit of armor. I think they go. It isn't scales by pounds. Is that how they do it in here? So 
be pounds of scales. I'm just going to say just a hide here. Okay, so dragon. Uh, black, dragon, hide. Uh, what do we say? For, how, what was the size of it? And then we would just remember. Let's just say it's enough for armor. a suit of leather armor. No, medium. Oh, so, okay. So, I'll put in parentheses. And Once. the both horns you're able to. Oops. Let's see if you can see those. I'm sure you know Both what they look like, but dragon horns. Awesome. Yeah, those big guys right there. You can shove those right into the. Yeah. Cool. He must work out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he doesn't skip leg day. Um, <laughs> cool. All right. You guys uh, divvy up the booty. Well. You want to just keep it all in the bag of holding, or do you want to... Yeah. The only thing that we'd anyone would want to use right away would probably be the Gauntlets of Ogre Power. It could be... Uh, it's not dark enough, but it could be you could use those goggles. Yes. Anybody else not have night vision? I think everybody else does. I don't have it, but I don't I don't want no. them. You would be more, more beneficial because you do range the time. Okay. Well, those are some shiny uh, peepers. All right, let me update your character to reflect dark vision. I'll just assume you put them on whenever. Yeah. Okay, so we're, we're all in agreement that Hickey get... Hell yeah. Okay. Yep. Uh, if, if no one's going to carry the rod, uh, I'll carry it. Um, no, thanks. I, I already got one. It's a little it, bit... In my <laughs> personal opinion, <laughs> I think Nimbus would probably be the best one for the gauntlet. No, I, I use dex, not strength, right. and my dex is already at 19, so... I can't, you can use either, I believe. Right, but there's no point, because I'm already getting the... Uh, I'm already oh. getting the benefit of a 19. Oh. So, the only other people that does, does some melee attacks is Leon, me, or the Baxel, right? He yeah. could be and good around just so he could have plate mail. <laughs> Get out of here. About it. <laughs> you already got some. <laughs> yeah. My my chain you got, shirt. You've gotten a lot of stuff, actually. You got a, like a dagger and all the other stuff. We <laughs> spread the wealth. So, did, did Tabaxel or Leon? Do you want that? If you're going to do melee attacks, or are you going to basically stay ranged most of the time? Um, I do melee, but like I said, I do dex anyways. My and I'm 18. Okay. So. So, what about you, Leon? I don't have use for strength. Then I guess it's okay. somebody could wear it just so they can wear heavy armor if they're proficient. Well, if, yeah, if you're proficient in it, and you, I think you should take it. I think blue would look pretty dope with gauntlets of strength, and you're more apt to do stuff. Yeah, that'll put me at another. That'll give me plus three to attack and damage when mm -hmm. I attack with my mace. Uh, yeah, I'll wear them. Yeah, oh, makes sense. All right, cool. And then, who wants the potion? Sweet. Uh, what was it? Supreme healing? Superior, Superior healing. Superior healing. Or that is, I believe, like 8 die 4 plus 10 or something it's ridiculous. It's a, a big one. And the sending stones, no re no point in putting them in the bag of holding. They're not doing any good in there. Yeah, it was, someone yeah. should carry them. Uh, someone who sneaks really... Uh, yeah, a scout. What do, what do they do again? I don't remember what they do. They're walkie-talkies. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I would say so, Tabaxel or I should take one and then... Yeah. And someone that stays with the main group right. takes another Yeah. So like, I'm, the, I'm the noisiest person. You want me to just hold on to it? Yeah. Why don't you take one and Tabaxel will take one, and Tabaxel and I can trade off if we need yeah, to. We there you go. Yeah. Perfect. All right. So putting this on my character sheet. And Tabaxel's oh, got the uh, immovable rod, or someone is it Tabaxel? Or? Yeah. If no one else wants to. Yeah. Either way, or we can throw it in the bag of holding. Whatever you want to do. Yeah, I just feel like if we have it, we can toss it back and forth if we need to real quick. Yeah, absolutely. Rather than having to take it out of a bag. There you go. Cool. All right, so I'll, I'll yeah, delete it from the list. Goog Googles. Goggles of the night. I think I got you set up Googles. so you can... <laughs> <laughs> I got the Googles. He ogles. Now He's got the ogles, ogles of the night. Um, cool. And the sending stones are out too. All right. Um, I need to put those on here too. Sending stone. All right, so that that makes my strength a nineteen, right? Because I think that's what my characters had. 
or one of the one of my player characters had. Yeah, the gauntlets make your strength a knight. Yeah. Boom. Excellent. Yeah, nineteen. Um, excellent. Okay, so I'll say you guys just make your way back up out of the cave. Well, now I have no problem climbing the rope. I'm like, <laughs> well, this is easy. And uh, yeah, so you make your way back up to Nanny Poo Poo, and she's waiting outside. And it's something you didn't notice before, standing next to, standing next to, but uh, sort of behind her little uh, cabin are a couple of it looks like newly dug graves. Oh, and they're, um, they're very large. Oh, what's Danny Poopo? What were those for? Poor villagers didn't make it. Nanny Poopoo tried to bring them back when she was learning how before she could get by Grandfather Bones, but they did not make it. Uh, did you happen to realize there was a dragon with the Petrie folk? Nanny Poopoo didn't tell you about the dragon. No, you, you did not mention that. Oh. You did not. I'm so forgetful. Please yes. excuse Nanny Poopo. Uh, as long as I can have more of that stew. Yes, yes, please. And um, she feeds you some stew. Tastes very familiar. Wait a minute. <laughs> I, I never had that, that stew. Yeah, I was going to say, you stew. didn't have <laughs> Tastes very familiar to Hickaby. <laughs> 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 Um, cool. So she uh, she thanks you and she she agrees to if uh, should one of you perish to to bring you back now that she's found a way to hide from uh, Grandfather Boons. Very nice. Thank you very much. So we have to bring the body back here. Is that what's going to happen? If we need the ability, Nanny Poopo can't climb down. She is too old. Yes. Okay. Is there anything else you need done, Nanny Poopo? No. Nanny Poopo is fine. Okay. Have fun, Stormy. Is there Dickens. a... <laughs> <laughs> do, uh, do we bring any dragon meat up? Systems yeah, sure. Oh, I, well, you know what? I would probably wouldn't be a good idea to eat it because of its, uh, the acid and stuff. And... I think the tail meat's okay as long as you stay away from the stomach. There you go. I know, because I, I, I have to ask for Hickory because I know he'd want it. He's like, that's a weird looking caiman. <laughs> Dragon nuggets. I think Hickory was already he talking about the, the tail, tail meat. meat. Yeah. Yeah. Cooking up some tails, too. So, so plop that down, maybe start no! cooking some of that up. Oh, yeah, fillet it up. She makes a, a nice spread for you guys. Uh, you can crash there, too, if you want to. It's getting maybe, probably getting close to dark anyway, so. Yeah. Um, cool. You wake up. You Share find stories with Dragon Bite and what's his name? Yeah, yeah. I'll, I won't remember the other guy's name ever. I'll just only remember Dragon Bite. <laughs> Artist Ember. Yeah. So Artist, you wake up and uh, you find Hickaby tied up in the pot. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <Yeah. Everything's laughs> oh, she's a hag. I get it. No, <laughs> no Nanny Poop is not a hag. She's just really, 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 really old. Um, cool. So you depart Mbala. You make your way back down without much trouble. And it's actually a six days journey, unfortunately, to Oralunga. Um, we're getting close to the end. I thought maybe what I would do was um, we can either end it here or I was going to, like we did last time, have you guys roll to see uh, about uh, random encounters on the way. Fun with me. Yeah, that works. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Who's oh, so, uh, rolling? Is it one per day? So six of them. It, it's it's in the book. It's three per day, but you, you can trim it down to twice per day. So one one day, one night, right. kind of thing. So who wants to do the first two rolls? I don't think I ever roll. Oh, there you go. Boom. <laughs> Nothing happens on day one. Oh, you're mm -hmm. up, Blue. 
All right, let's see here. Two die twenties. Oh, Ooh. yeah! Now you killed us. You killed us. <laughs> <laughs> what color dragon do you want to fight now? <laughs> <laughs> yes, the, the um, dead kind. <laughs> so, on a crit, oh wait, not the undead kind. <laughs> um, let me just roll and see. Sometimes these random encounters are crazy, but I'll take a isn't look. A, isn't isn't a crit like I get to pick? <laughs> no, we just double the amount of mobs we get. We'll see. Let's see. You can either have a kraken, uh, uh, um, what is it, a tarasque, and some or of them are just, uh, completely benign. And uh, this may be, but uh, you walk around the corner and you see um, how many. Six. Uh, apes, and they are, they've swatted down a huge bunch of bananas from uh, a banana tree, and they're just sort of loping and uh, eating and, and uh, enjoying the bananas off the side of this little trail that's leading to Oralonga. And they sort of just uh, eye you suspiciously, uh, but the bananas do look delicious. I suggest we give them a wide berth. Yeah, I would agree. All right. Most definitely. Um, I think one person make an animal handling check. Whoever's got that. I have four in it. I don't, I'm not. I'm not. I don't have it as a skill, though. I may have it as a skill. I got five. Roll it up. That seems like the perfect thing. I gotta uh, roll one Maybe balloon. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah. That's good. One of them stands up and shits in his own hand and throws it at you, but it misses. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. And that's uh, that's all that happens that day. Um, all right, here comes day I number. I walk over and steal one of his bananas. <laughs> <laughs> You're attacked. Uh, <laughs> what is it? Two d twenties. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right, I'll roll. Oh no! Come on, oh no! Man. Yeah, seventeen's yes. fine. I thought it was oh, eighteen. Okay. Yeah, we're just going to do eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. So that day, also nothing happens. Mm. Who's next? Anyone? Oh, no. there. I already rolled. Oh, okay. Yeah, I thought I heard typing for it. Six. And no, I was just typing. Through. I'm typing all going to go gauntlet or ogre power on my. Oh. On my other care sheet in other places. Gotcha. One more roll. Yep, one more roll. Leon. Uh, nope. Sorry about that. Oh, no. Uh, Leon, go ahead. No, he rolled a seventeen. No, no was- Leon, you rolled a six, but you you need to roll one more d twenty. Oh, okay. Because it's two rolls per day. Right. Okay, sixteen. You're good. Nice. Another day with nothing happening. Um, and one more day. So, who wants to roll? I got it. Go for it. Nice. All right. You. I want to start at night, if it's all right. I want to start making a copy of my map. Okay. Yeah, for sure. So when we stop, I'll just I'll be doing that. So I have two. Yeah. Good idea. That way I can hand the one to the guy who wants it, and we still have ours. All right. So let me yeah. put you somewhere, and uh, thankfully, what you see here. Let me show you something. Uh, no, not yet. Let me show you this first. Uh, you see uh, the beginning of a crumbling city. So, um, Orlunga, you see what you saw, the, the massive brick stone ziggurat rising out of the jungle. And... Uh, Two staircases angle up and across the front face, one from the right, the other from the left. They meet <laughs> at, <laughs> They meet at a landing on the second level, 30 feet above your heads. The layout repeats on the second level and then the third, but with each successive layer adding less height than the one below it. The fourth level, 60 feet above the jungle floor, is enclosed is an enclosed shrine or temple. 
Its walls adorned with labyrinth symbols that you've come to recognize as Uptal symbol. Um, the jungle encroaches right up to and onto this ancient structure. The first flights of steps are choked with creepers, tree roots, flowering vines. The vestiges of what must have been a thriving city, foundations, tumbled stones, can, see, can just be seen beneath the dense jungle. <laughs> you weren't. Um, and at the very base of this stone ziggurat is another one of the symbols of Uptown. Oh, like the teleporty thing? Yeah. Nice. Yes, so Snarm recognizes it. And, oops, damn it. And his amulet does its thing. It draws, draws the, goes through the, uh, through so the maze. Awesome. A blue moat flies out uh, to mark Oralanga. And there it is. And I think that, I think that's where we'll wrap it up tonight. Before we get into Oralunga proper, I think that's a good stopping point. Yeah. So hold on, I have a couple, uh, uh, at least one story. Yeah. So uh, back when uh, three point five came out, they had a a module, uh, and that module was um, like it was all about this, you know, going through this cave system and fighting these things. I forgot exactly what it was, but at the end of it, you, you worked your way down into an area where there was this big, huge, like underground lake. And as it, it's so it's got the box text and I'm reading the box text and it's like out of the dark water, you see this, uh, this body of a scaly lizard slowly rising up about the size of a large horse. We're like, what? Horse. And, and, uh, yeah, it was a black dragon. Oh. <laughs> I'm like, that does not instill fear at all. It's no. like the size of a small horse. I'm like, That's everybody just looked at me funny. And I'm like, no, no, it's the size of a small house. Forget this. <laughs> <laughs> was it a typo or did it really like, just say horse? <laughs> no, it's because it was, it was a baby dragon. So uh, they're about the size of a small horse. A worm. But that's yeah. like, it was the worst. That did not instill fear in anybody at all. <laughs> and then it's like roll for fear or whatever. And I'm like, what? Does it have a saddle? <laughs> yeah. And I forgot what my other one was. But it's too funny. That's pretty cool. Excellent. Yeah. I'm going to kill the video.